Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you one of my two mail calls I got this week. The second mail call will be shown in a couple of days, so definitely keep an eye out for that one. Um, now, the mail call for this week is quite special to me because it's really difficult to get at the moment. Although I do think that they will become more available in the future. Um, but first, if you're new to my channel, hi! My name is Angela and I make Harry Potter videos. Please click the subscribe button if you want to stay up to date about everything that's happening here on my channel. Okay, and now let me show you which item I got this week. Um, and it's really special. It's this really stunning Harry Potter Bricktober set. And this set uh, was released um, as a Toys R Us uh, exclusive. But I don't know what happened with the Toys R Us uh, stores, but well, in the end, uh, this item became very difficult to get. Now, a friend of mine drove all the way to Germany to get me one, um, so I'm forever grateful to him. Um, now, I really like the display of this, so I'm not going to take them out of their packaging. Uh, but I'm going to show you um, each one individ individually um, and tell you which character it is and what makes it so special. So the first one is Madame Hooch. And Madame Hooch is um, wearing her broom and... Um, her cape, of course, and then her wand. So, and we all know her as the uh, flying um, professor, flying lessons professor. So she's wearing her um, Hogwarts dress robes as well. Yes. And then the second one is, of course, Professor Slughorn. Um, and Professor Slughorn will always be a very uh, special character to me because he changes into a chair, which is quite, in, well, into a chair or into a couch, uh, which is quite um, special. And he also got his uh, wand, and um, I think that is a, I don't know what it is, a potion bottle or something. Now, Professor Slughorn was the um, Defense Against the Dark Arts uh, teacher, so I'm quite lost as why he would be having a potions bottle with him. Is there something special that I'm missing about Professor Slughorn? If there is, then please let me know in the comments down below. Uh, sometimes my mind isn't what it used to be, so... Now the third character is a character we all hate and love, um, but which is also very special to this set, and that's Dolores Umbridge. Now, um, Dolores Umbridge is the Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher during the Order of the Phoenix, um, but she's not really loved, which is quite an understatement. Um, now in this set she has got her wand with her and um, her cup of tea. The, um, I'm just surprised that there aren't any cats on it. No, it just it seems like just a blank cup of tea. Oh, she's got a pin badge on the front uh, with a cat on it. Um, if I can't show you like this, then I will film this set uh, separately and put this in the video and put it in the video so you can all see uh, all the details. So she's of course completely in pink because what else would Dolores Umbridge be wearing? The last character is a very special one as well because it's uh, the Boggart um, dressed as a Snape in Neville Longbottom's grandma clothes. So of course this is the um, laughable Boggart uh, version. Um, from, um, of Neville's greatest nightmare, which is Professor Snape, of course. So, yeah, that looks amazing, just the hat and the handbag and the fake fur. fur. Now, um, this set is special, of course. Now, there are a few characters that have been included in sets in the past, and that's Madame Hooch. She was in the very first 
um, Quidditch set as well, but I think her character um, was yellow then, so had a yellow hat and yellow hands. Professor Slughorn, he is completely new, so he is a very exclusive character for this one. Then, of course, uh, we've got a prof uh, Professor Umbridge. Now, Professor Umbridge was part of uh, the Hogwarts cast, I think, the third version. Version. Um, so that's the version of the. So that's the version of the Order of the Phoenix. Um, and then the bugger, the Snape, he was part. Um, of an older set as well, but he looked completely different in that one. But uh, just I think the set was called Lupin's Classroom. I'm not sure. It's a quite an old set, so I don't have it, which is a shame, of course. But that is the way it is. Now I'm hoping that these will be released some more, because then I can buy a second one and use those four figures um, in my Lego sets. Now this one is going to stay. In its, in its original packaging because I really like this and um, it's a collector's item as well so yeah it's going to stay right here at the moment um, and that's it for my first mail call of the week now I hope you liked this video then if you did please give it a big thumbs up and click the link down below to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next week for the second mail call guys bye